Hey there, this is Cody with Sonic Electronics and I'm here to help you decide on which video system to choose, headrest or an overhead system. It's the age-old question, do I get a headrest monitor or a flip-down monitor? Well, one of the first questions you should be asking yourself is, who's going to be using the screen and what kind of cars are going into? Do you drive around with people in your back seat who can never agree on anything? Well, you might want to check out dual DVD player headrest monitors. This way you can enjoy the silence while they watch their own favorite movies, with headphones on, of course. So maybe that isn't the case. Maybe you have a larger vehicle, like an excursion or a suburban, and have three rows of seats. If that's true, you may want to go with an overhead monitor. This way more people can watch without having to replace four headrests. So then, what if you have a smaller midsize or a compact car? A 17-inch flip-down screen might not be the most practical choice for you since you might not even have room to flip the screen down. On the other hand, maybe you do have a bigger car, and you're the kind of person who likes to have tailgate parties or party on the beach with your friends. An overhead monitor might be perfect for you since you can get much larger screens than you'll find on a headrest. So you're the person who wants to have a perfect match in your ride. Well, with the higher end headrest monitors like the ones from CarShow, you can get custom match colors that'll match your interior perfectly. Or if you're a baller on a budget like I am, who still wants a factory match without spending too much money, you'll want to go with an overhead monitor since you can match the interior of your car without it being exact. When it comes down to it, both the flip down and headrest have their own benefits. If you have a smaller vehicle, want more viewing options, and want to have a look as close to factory as possible, you'll probably want to go with the headrest monitor. If you have a bigger vehicle with more seat rows, have cloth seats, and want the biggest screen you can get to entertain everyone, you'll probably want to go with an overhead. Of course, the decision is up to you, but hopefully with these general guidelines, you have a place to start. And hey, if you really want to turn your ride into a media entertainment hub, you can always go with both. So until the next action-packed episode, this is Cody telling you to get all your video needs at Sonic Electronics. Thank <laughs> you.